Killer bees do make honey. Yes, killer they bees do. are well, killer bees are sort of a misnomer. So basically, there were bees that were taken from different regions of Africa, brought to South America. Those bees were then studied because they were a little bit smaller than European honeybees. They reproduced more quickly than European honeybees. And as a result, there was experiments going on in Brazil around these honeybees. But as Mary pointed out, bees are an unpredictable species. They're domesticated, but they don't totally follow what humans want. Some escaped. They have the capacity to supplant other European hives by installing their own queen. And once they do that, a, a hive can turn over to being um, Africanized, an Africanized hive. This has been moving up through the borders across the United States border, probably to about southern Georgia. And the USDA and other border forces have tracked where these Africanized bees are traveling to because there's a lot of fear about them. And part of the fear is that, yes, indeed, they don't have more venomous stings, they don't, they're not trying to aggressively get you, but if they are rattled, they will go farther and longer to try and sting. And the fact that they nest inside buildings, underneath the ground, means that humans' actions sometimes disturb those bees in ways that we don't disturb European honeybees because they have different nesting patterns. Mm -hmm. So they are a threat, but in Buzz we talk a lot about how that threat has sort of been managed by existing tropes about race and ethnicity and racism and borders that exist with respect to human populations and how bees become another way of expressing anxieties about the border and about race and ethnicity. Mm -hmm. The Africanized bees are basically sort of bees that are out of control somehow and they're not paying attention to sort of all of the rules um, about entering the country. And um, in terms of um, how they're different from other bees, I would say that they're just more robust they seem to be hardier in a sense, you know, and so that that particular trait is basically capitalized on and then used in a pejorative sense to sort of make them different in this way that we should all be fearful of.